Hey guys, thanks for tuning in at Neb's Garage. On this episode, we're going to be making a gauge cup for this MY99WRX. Now, it's going to be a pillar mounted pod, but it isn't going to be one of those ones that sticks out like a camel's hump. It's going to be a nice, unique, modest little gauge cup. We're going to make it from scratch. It's going to be real easy. Come on, let's get into it. All right, so it's basically just going to sit in there, tucked out of the way, right? Down in against the windscreen. So we're just going to have to make a little cup that this pushes into, right? It's pretty simple. So let's take some measurements now. All right, cool. Let's get to shaping. All right, now believe it or not, our mold is gonna be made out of this florist foam. Now this is a tip from my mate Matty, and he also supplied me with the foam for the job. Get on your Batman. Now let's cut this out and get shaping. All right, we're basically just gonna to wanna to carve off a chunk of this. So, just with the measurements we uh, took in the car. I think I'm going to square it off to start with. Like this. Kind of want it about this long. Alright. Alright, cool. So here's our block. Now we've just got to sort of start shaping it to size. Alright, so just uh, put some lines on here by eye from in the car. So I'm just going to do some carving now. Alright, so I've sort of got a basic shape now. Now I'm going to make the hole for the gauge. Now this is a bit of two inch pipe. Same size as the gauge, so I'm going to start making the hole. Okay, now it looks it's looking pretty good in the car. Now I'm going to try the gauge. This is the gauge I plan to use. I'm going to check it for depth. So we need at least 45 mil depth. Which is a lot more than what we've got at the moment. So I need to keep milling. Okay. So I'm basically just going to use this ruler. Alright, so how cool does that look? Alright. So what I need to do now... Just make sure the wiring and the hose and everything can get in and out of it. It's just going to fit in there like that. It's a beautiful fit. I want the entry for the hose to be here, sort of thing. Alright, 
Yeah, we should sure be able to do. It's on a right angle. Yep, that'll work. And the wiring. Yep, that'll work too. All right, cool. Okay, now I just need to finish off the shaping of it. I've actually carved a little bit too much off this corner and the bottom. So I'm just gonna get some toothpicks now, like this, and just push into here. And I'm actually just gonna put another piece on here like this. Right. Okay, like that. And then continue shaping again. Okay, so this is where we're at now. There's the unit sitting in there. All right, it's got a basic shape. Fits around the pillar and the dash and everything pretty well. That's how it's gonna look from the side. Nice and neat. Okay, cool. Let's start uh, glassing it. All right, so check it out. It's the next morning now. Cool. All right, so I guess we can start sanding it now and everything, see how it sands up. Let's do that. Alright, so I've done some sanding and a little bit more shaping. Taken some pieces out where it's a bit proud. So I'm going to give it another coat of resin now.
All right, so our next coat has cured now. All right. So it's time to demount and start finishing. All right, so here we go. Give it a bit of a sand and it's fitting in the car pretty well. So I'm just gonna do some finishing now with some plastic filler. All right, guys. Well, here she is. It's all been sanded now, and I've filled all the imperfections with plastic filler. Looks pretty sweet, eh? You want to see what she looks like with a gauge in it? Let's do it. nice insertion right there check it out got clearance on the back for all the fittings the wiring spoiler alert you'll see this boost gauge in one of our upcoming videos make sure you get on the socials and follow us or hit the subscribe button now let's see what she's gonna look like in the car all right Slide it in there. Look at that. Pretty nice, huh? Yep, looks pretty good. Alright, guys. See you next time. Whoa, 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 whoa. Hey, I was only joking. Don't roll credits. Back it up. You think this is some kind of patina shop? I'm not going to paint this yet. Come on guys, seriously. Alright guys, check it out. There she is. Alright. Okay, so I've sanded it. Bit of plastic filler. Etch primed it. Put a nice light texture coat on there and then give it a coat of satin black. Pretty nice, huh? Let's see what it looks like in the car. What do you think about that? It's pretty good, eh? Alright guys, well that's it. We've got our boost gauge pod made now. I suppose we need to fill it with a boost gauge. So make sure you jump onto the socials and follow us at Gosson Media. And also subscribe to our YouTube channel. Make sure you're notified when the next video drops. Don't want to miss out. Until then, please keep liking and sharing. We'll see you next time on Nev's Garage.